Hello guys, today I will show you how to install CarBridge. CarBridge is an application that allows you to transfer various applications from your phone straight to the panel in your car and watch, for example, YouTube. So, if you want to see how to install CarBridge, watch this video until the end, and step by step, I'll show you how to do it. Before we start, we need to check two important things, and this step is specifically for iOS users. If you have an Android device, skip to the main method for installing this app. Go to Settings, then General, and click on Background App Refresh, making sure that either Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi mobile data is selected, one of these two options. Then return click on Battery, and check if the Low Power Mode option is unchecked, just like mine, as it could negatively impact the app, so we need to have it turned off. Now, we can start the final step. Click on your browser and go to theaprilia.com. It's a verified site with various modded applications. Enter CarBridge, click on it, and a window will pop up with various information, such as the number of downloads or community ratings. Click the Download Now button, and the system will start downloading and installing. It won't take long, and in a moment, everything will be ready, and you should see a message confirming that everything has been successfully installed. If you do not see this message, it means that the server needs updating and will have to download additional files. This is a very simple and quick step to do, and everything will be shown exactly how to do it. Once you have completed this step, the system will immediately download the files, and the installation will be successful. I have already installed it, and as you may have noticed, everything works perfectly. And that's it. This is all the process we need to install CarBridge. Thanks for watching this video to the end. If you liked the video and everything is working for you, leave a like and subscribe to my channel to follow more content like this. If you have any problems or questions, feel free to write in the comments and I'll be happy to help you. Thanks and see you in my next video.